Hi, I'm Jonathan. I'm here from the Yorkshire Food Guide and we're here at the Yorkshire Dales Food and Drink Festival with Stoves, who's kindly provided all the kitchen appliances for the demo tents today. And Lisa, you've been demoing earlier. What did you cook for us? I cooked some scotch eggs and romesco sauce. Oh, perfect. Mm. And um, would you say that's a good dish for a dinner party because we're thinking about doing the staying in? Uh, yeah, I think Scott, the great thing about scotch egg, it goes from brunch to snack to dinner party. Yeah. You know, especially because there's always a bit of trepidation. Is the egg going to be too hard? Are yes. you going to have a nice, perfect yolk? Um, I was talking to Mary Berry, who's here as well, and she was saying she only likes scotch eggs when they're warm. And so they okay. are a really nice dish for a dinner party, especially with the romesco sauce on the side. It's a bit different, a bit different from Pico Lily. So yeah, I think it can work. Perfect. And is there any top tips what you'd suggest for um, doing the perfect dinner party in terms mm. of cooking? The, the perfect dinner party in terms of cooking. Open a glass of wine, open a bottle of wine yeah. and have a nice glass of wine while you're cooking. And know that when you're doing a dinner party, you're cooking for friends and they will love whatever you make. So serve it with a smile and don't get too stressed. Make something that you know how to make. Yes, yeah, definitely. Have you got anything, any dilemmas or any disasters, what's happened at a dinner party or cooking with friends? Um, uh, I don't think I've really had many disasters, but mainly because I think you can always turn a disaster into something good. You just have to not tell somebody what it was meant to be right in the first off. place. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Perfect. And in terms of the atmosphere for the dinner party, what would you say is a perfect atmosphere? Or how would you? I just that? think what you want is to be able to put a load of plates in the middle of the table where everyone can help themselves and yeah. not feel scared that it's like a master, an episode of MasterChef. Yeah. It should just be fun <laughs> to have a nice, you know, some wine or some you know, whatever you want, a couple of gin and tonics and cocktails, um, and just to everyone dig in and chat and not worry about it. 